Merry Christmas from KB9 VBR. Are hams notoriously picky people to shop for? What is the average amateur radio operator interested in? Hi, I'm Michael, KB9VBR. Today on Ham Radio Q&A, I go through a list of gift ideas that just about any ham would love to see under the tree. This list has items at a wide range of price points, so you'll find something that works great as a stocking stuffer or as a capstone gift this holiday season. Shopping links for these products can be found in the show description below or on my blog at www.jpole-antenna.com. First on the list, the Nagoya NA771 antenna for Baofeng handheld radios. If you're using one of the Chinese handheld radios, you really need this antenna. It has more gain and better performance than the stock antenna that comes with the radio. According to the specs, the 15.6 inch model would give you about 2.1 dB of gain. I'd question that actual amount, but for one thing is for sure, is that this antenna will work better than the included one, which has dismal performance. Speaking of antennas, the next big way you can increase your handheld's performance is with an externally mounted antenna like my J-Pole and Slim Jim antennas. Why fight with trying to use your radio in the house when you can install an antenna outside, off your deck, on your roof, or even in your attic? The step up in performance will be amazing. Not only that, it'll work great with your handheld radio. And it'll also be ready for you when you upgrade to a full power VHF UHF base station. You can purchase the KB9 VBR 2 meter J pole or Slim Jim antennas direct on my website or on eBay under seller ID KB9 VBR. Handheld radios are great. I use mine all the time, but nothing beats the power and sensitivity of a 2 meter mobile and base station radio. My favorite 2 meter rig is currently the Kenwood TM281A. This transceiver has loud, crisp audio out of its front facing speaker. It scans fast and has 65 watts of power. At about $165, you can afford two, one for the car and another for the house. What's the next step up from the TM281A? Why, it might just might be the ICOM 5100A. This dual band VHF UHF radio has an innovative touchscreen display, dual receive, D-Star, built-in GPS, 500 memories, and a Bluetooth option for hands-free operation. The radio practically does it all. Retail price is $750, so it's quite an investment. But if you want state-of-the-art in your vehicle, this is the model to look at. Stepping back from those lofty wishes, here's a few other gift ideas that may fall into budget. Got a hand that likes to tinker with electronic projects? The Weller WES-51 soldering station makes a great gift for the ham that likes to wield an iron. Fast warm-up precision heat control and electro electrostatic protection makes it a welcome addition to the workbench. It retails for about $99, but can be found for less online. Finally, how about some books? The ARL has an excellent library of titles available. Any ham would love a copy of the ARL handbook. This is the gold standard reference for amateur radio communications and is relied on by amateurs and professional RF engineers alike. You'll find it for about $50 in the ARL website or on Amazon. Did you or your ham buddy just get their license and have questions? Besides reading my blog, the next best place to go is the ARL's operating manual. This book is filled with information on modes and practices, operating techniques, and general reference for the radio amateur. You'll find it for about $25 on the ARL site or on Amazon. Finally, here's a stocking stuffer that, uh, that's appropriate for every ham, but everyone that likes to make and build. The Pocket Ref is a tiny book filled with charts, formulas, tables, and information on just about everything electrical and mechanical. Sure, you can probably find the same information on the internet, but this compact guide has it all in one convenient spot. From algebra to zinc, you'll find it in the Pocket Ref. It's only $12.95 and is available in most hardware stores, bookstores, and online. While this isn't a comprehensive list, these are all items that just about any ham needs or wants. Do you have a gift wish this holiday season? Why not leave it in the comments below? And for more Christmas holiday gift ideas, check out my blog at www.jpole-antenna.com for past selections. Thanks for watching today. Do you like this video and would love to see more? Be sure to subscribe to my channel 
and also check out my Facebook page where the conversation continues. I'm Michael, KB9VBR. Once again, thanks for watching. Happy holidays, Merry Christmas, and 73.